Hello, beautiful souls. Uh, I'm in a different area, so I'm not too sure if it uh, sounds echoish, but I don't think so. <laughs> but I just wanted uh, to show up uh, in regards to the energy that you are facing. Now, um, this is a connection to the message or if you have been... If you were touched by this nostalgic type of energy, right, whether is it that it just showed up, it just came up, or if it was in your dream state, is connection to that. Um, as I have been um, telling you guys that uh, recently in my videos that I've been trying to connect uh, to my soul a lot more. And yesterday I asked my soul and my higher self to let me um, know uh, why the energy is coming up. And even though this is an energy that I do not wish to feel, because it feels so raw, it feels so real, um, it's something that I have to confront. And I think... Um, it's not that I think, I know that I'd rather do everything else except for um, feeling this energy. And as I'm doing this, my fingers are tingling, so I would have to check what that means. Um, but, yes, um, it's something that I have to face. It's just like, sooner or later, this energy is going to catch up to you. <laughs> <laughs> when um and that's why you have this kind of love and hate relationship towards it right and you know you can go on your spiritual journey you can go on this uh, spiritual uh this uh journey of self growth right um but if this is not confronted then it will show up and this is something, you know, it, it gets to, the energy gets bigger and bigger until it's like, hey, it is time to, to try to look at this again. And, um, One of the things that you, you really have to accept, right? And there could be a lot, uh, there can be uh, something uh, that you're in denial, okay? Um, because it's something that you want to, you want to make a, you want to make up a reason for uh, why, you haven't faced it or why it has why something has not been done right but it's letting us know it's like i know that you are working on yourself in different areas i know that we see that we are aware of it but this is something that must be faced in order for you to continue on this next step of your growth, right? And this can be um, regarding self-love and, uh, you know, your divine feminine energy, right? I think uh, if anybody can relate to this, if you are a feminine, um, if you're feminine, right, you were born uh, as a feminine, um, you're in your, and you use your masculine energy, that is something that we have to heal. We have to um, balance these two energies out. It's just like, I don't even know how to balance both of these energies out within myself. It's like, uh, yeah. And this is one of the things that you are needing to confront. 
and you might feel some triggering uh, happening, um, but understand that you allow it to come up to the surface and allow yourself to accept that um, you are in denial when it comes to this and saying, okay, <laughs> I want to start working on this or how is it that I can make things happen because it's, it's like if you're moving forward like if we do not heal this we are moving forward and we feel overwhelmed we feel that we have everything like we're carrying everything in our shoulders and it's like where is the help right where is it I'm and it's because you tend to want to do this all by yourself. And you're kind of closing out on that feminine energy, right? So one of the things that we can do is, okay, um, how, do I, how do we start, right? Um, the answers will come to you. You just have to be open to them, just like me. Um, this is also my journey. I'm, I consider myself feminine, but um, in the outside, it reflects a lot of masculine energy, a lot. <laughs> I'm like, I just want to be also a pillow princess. I just want to be there, <laughs> you know. But so that's where we can't hide any longer. We. We can't make up excuses anymore, okay? Uh, the time to shine is for us now. And this is something that has to uh, be corrected in order for us to be able to receive more opportunities, okay? All right, my beautiful friends, thank you so much. I do appreciate all of you. And God bless you on your journey. Thank you. Namaste.